Love this modem so far. Runs very stable so far and also runs much cooler than my Iris SP8200. Also like the built-in surge protection. Easy to activate on Comcast network via automated walled garden method, I, E. No need to call Comcast support. Getting 29 actual, locked, downstream channels, one of which is OFDM, and 3 upstream channels. Download and upload speeds measured with speed test are above my tier and more importantly are consistent with no disconnects so far, up almost 2 days, just bought it. It also passed the Puma 6 inline quality tests, for report site, with flying colors, note, this is not a Puma 6 mode, do not worry, however it can still run the test. Also love the power button which the SP8200 lacks. Hands down the best modem I've ever owned. Lives up to gigabit speeds like so many others claim to, but do not. I have owned a couple of Doxus 3.0 modems that claimed they could do gigabit speeds. Not true. Without getting into a bunch of technical numbers this modem and two other DOCSIS 3. One consumer models are the only ones that appear to qualify. I can confirm 950 megabits per second using wave broadband. Speeds will vary depending on time of day, number of users online etc. The numbers speak for themselves. Considering the cable company usually charges $10 plus a month for their modem, I figured after a bit over a year this modem will have paid for itself. Now it has been over 2 years and I am using it with a different cable company. I have used it with both Cox and Xfinity and each time it was as simple as calling and reading off the numbers to them. I've been running 1 gigabit per second internet and this modem has room to grow if they ever expand in the area certainly has paid for itself. Cut the cable recently and installed 5 Rokus at home. My old 100 MBS internet was getting the herky jerkies when everyone was online. Upped my internet connection to 400 MBS and found my old modem was obsolete so rather than rent a modem for 10 bucks a month, I did the research and found that the new standard for modem protocol is 3. 1. The Motorola MB8600 replaced my SB6121 and speeds went up over 4x even the Spectrum Tech was impressed. Great modem. I was debating between Aris SP8200, Netgear CM1000 and this Motorola MB8600. I've ended up buying the Motorola and I couldn't be happier. It runs cool and blazing fast. I'm in Phoenix, Arizona using this modem with Cox Communication on Doxis 3. 1. The installation was super easy. I was up and running in less than 10 minutes I'm getting 944 megabits per second download and 36 megabits per second upload. Very happy with this purchase. The MB8600 is the best Doxis 3. One modem you can get currently. With the correct lag slash lasp setup. Hardware configuration This modem is able to max out my gig service with Spectrum. Provisioning at this tier is 1220 MB/s down and 42 MB/s up, and it's able to saturate the connection when using LAT, multi gig router, and client. I would say anyone having issues using this modem are running into something unrelated to it. The modem has 100% stable and reliable for me, even if you don't want or can use the last option of the MB8600 it would provide maximum throughput at any speed tier. <laughs> Click link in description for more reviews and best price.